I think the main challenge of being a, uh, an international rugby player and playing for such a big club is probably injury. I think that's probably the biggest challenge. I think mentally is the biggest thing you have to overcome. Obviously, I've just come, up, come away from an injury having broken my neck, and that's you know probably one of my biggest challenges so far is to actually try and overcome that and build myself back up and get fit. And you know the biggest challenge then will be to take that pitch again and have the confidence to go and play. And that's you know that's why I'm training as hard as I can at the moment, along with a, a very good conditioning staff at Les Tigers, to get myself into that position and have that confidence there to you know get back on the pitch and uh, play the game you love. Tom's lengthy spell away with injury has left him feeling frustrated. And despite the progress in his recovery, he cannot wait to get back onto the field to do what he loves most. Um, my recovery is going very well from my injury. Um, we are three months into the process, uh, seeing a specialist next week, and you know things are, things are on track, if not ahead of time. Obviously, like I say, it's a very frustrating time being injured. You want to be out, you know, on the pitch training with the boys during pre-season, yet you, you're stuck in the gym. But. You know, the strength and conditioning staff at Leicester are exceptionally good, along with the couple with the physio team. You know, they, they kind of gradually build you back into things. They, they build you up from, you know, have, having been bedridden for the neck for, you know, three, four weeks with a neck collar into, you know, someone that you can actually build on and actually hopefully improve. You know, although injury is, is, is a pain, you have to take the, uh, the, the lighter side, the fact that you can work on other areas. So I've had a summer off, I've had time to recover, and I can, you know, work on other areas of my body, which,